Evening guys, hope that you can see us and just let us know in the comments. We've got all this new setup this evening. Whether it goes to plan ad is always another thing. Anything and everything happens at darkplanet.tv on the live streams. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Second week back. All's good, isn't it? And your hair's looking good. I see yeah. that uh, Laura's been looking after you. I've been in makeup before um, we went yeah. live. So, yeah, should be making it extra sexy tonight. Fantastic. Let us know in the comments and everybody if you can see us. We will be taking your questions uh, throughout the night. Now, as you all know, we are going to be playing some cash darts tonight. Yes, that's right. Many of you have put your names down. Adam's going to be in charge of picking the draws tonight. We've got some fantastic... Um, Giveaways again tonight on the raffle. Let's show you what's up for grabs. First, tonight, if anything crashes, again, it's the internet. We've done the speed test. So apologies for that. It could well happen. But first prize tonight is this signed Bully Boy Michael Smith shirt. Had a couple on the show before. Been really popular. For every pound you put in, you're going to get your name in the raffle. Second prize tonight is one of the elusive ad. Oh, Mystery boxes. This one didn't sell out in four minutes then, this one. This one was taken uh, especially for tonight's show. This must in there. That is second prize this evening. And third prize is this awesome set of Blackout Win More Darts. Now, well, what I these, personally love them. And what they guarantee is you've all seen me play. You all know how good I am. Anybody that wins these is going to be guaranteed to throw similar averages to me at. Yes, which is... Really good, bad average. So, are you being generous for that? Yeah, you're being very generous. <laughs> I love the statement being generous. He is. So that is third prize tonight. But sponsoring tonight's show is Pure Innocence. Alan Collins and Mark. They have got a fantastic bundle here. This is going to be drawn out. I can't show you because they'll all fall out, but we'll show you at the end of the show. These are going to be drawn out to a VIP member tonight. There's about four to five hundred pounds worth of goodies in here. So one of you VIPs are going to get your uh, hands on that. So don't forget to check out www.pureinnocence.co.uk. Also, we've been running a competition uh, throughout the show, um, throughout the day, sorry, let's just have a look. This is going to be announced tonight. Now, nobody, there was about two or three hundred guests. Well, I had to ring you up earlier in the day, didn't I, and say, right, I even I don't know. But they them. still don't know. But what I can tell you is, somebody have guessed who this is this evening um, and will be uh, getting their hands on this box. It's actually down here. I can't reveal it yet because it's got the person's name on it. So before we go any further, what have you been up to, Ad? Not a lot, mate, really. Um, I was going to say that, guys, if you draw me to play me for the money, take it easy on me because I haven't thrown any darts since I last saw you last Sunday. So um, I'm just back at work, everything back to normal. No, you need your dartboard. Yeah, yeah, I'm a dartboard down. I've got a dartboard to throw out in a minute because Gav's nicked that. Um. <laughs> had to nick the dartboard. <clears throat> and Connor, we've been playing loads yeah. and loads during the we've week. Had, we've had uh, some absolute real ding dongs. We've had 26 legs altogether in the last week. Uh, best of 19. Uh, before we say who wins, let's put down in the comments who fought one out of 26 legs. We clearly know who um, who won, by the way, that Connor's speaking. Thank you so much for all your donations coming in. Let's just say our food to so the people, guys. Yeah, uh, Sunny Delights, he's coming with a fiver. Thank Happy you Father's much. Day, everyone, by the way. Yes. I hope you're all being, uh, I can't say that word, so I'm not even going to try to. I can't say TH, but uh, Connor will always try and get me to do it. But I hope you've all been... Fuck, you say the word. Thoroughly. Funnily. Th th Funnily. I hope that you've... <laughs> I hope that you've all been really, really sport. Yeah. We always have a laugh. Um, so, yeah, absolutely awesome. We're going to be having the Chinese afterwards and some fun. Let's have a look at some of the questions that are coming through. Uh, Ellie the Raffler Rook Guard is in a new well, position. we do say Ellie the Raffler, but recently we have thought of a nickname change. As all Ellie has been making, literally for weeks now... Is salads, salads, salads. So we're thinking of changing Ellie's name to Ellie the Saddler Rookyard. And every single salad has um, avocado and grapes in. And, and don't forget, I hit two 140s. Oh, Ellie's hit two 140s as well, so she's absolutely buzzing. Uh, two 180s. Uh, Connor's had a couple of 180s, and I've had one, haven't yeah. I? So Connor's in the lead with the 180s. Um, but yeah, we're thinking of calling that Ellie the Saddler Rookyard, Saddler Rookyard because she also liked Nico Avocado or something on YouTube no, as well. No, don't yes, you I do, do Ellie. No, yes, you do. Uh, are you feeling confident tonight, Ad? The prize wheel's going to be coming out. Are you going to be yeah, costing me a lot of money? Some, we've got some good 
Money, uh, cash prizes on there. Uh, I'm feeling really confident. There's a, there's a jackpot one for 50 quid, and then there's some 10s, 25s, 20s, and 15s. So. Now, I know how bad you're playing. I've drawn a lot yeah, of he's, money. Yeah, Dan's had to go to the cash machine because he's seen my current form. Um, I was just <laughs> saying in the comments, some people are commenting on the uh, win the Father's Day Rooster Box, and one person, I won't say who it is, but one person in the comments has put the correct answer in there. Yes, but one person, there was somebody today that also did, and it will be revealed tonight. I cannot believe, I think there was something like 130 odd comments on the uh, website yesterday, and then on Twitter it went mad, and everybody was uh, DMing me, is it this person, is it that person, right, I'm not going to give anything away. And then there was about another 130 today, plus a couple of hundred on Twitter. Nobody named the two right players. No, and then all I, of a sudden, I looked on the group, and bang, there it I got, was. I got one straight away. As soon as I looked at it, the bottom one, I knew who that was straight away. But Dad, the top one Stephen Erk has had a special request from you. Has he? He wants you to say penguin. He says, please say penguin, Dad, <laughs> pretty please. No, I, I really, I really... Dad, John Gwynn. Yeah, I can say it if I say John Gwynn. Uh, Peng Gwynn. Yeah, we go. That is the only way that we do it. Laura uh, caught me out on that ages ago, didn't she, Cons? Mm -hmm. uh, let's have a look. Let's be getting some of this up ready because shortly they're going to be having a game on the board. So let me just set this up. Barney boy, you just come in with your comments for who you think the mystery box is. You, you, you're not even close, mate. Not even close. Isn't he? Not even from the same era or generation. <laughs> who did Barney say? Let's have a look. He's Wolfie and Wolfie. Golf for Wolfie and Walshie. Oh, Barney. Barney, 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 Barney boy. <laughs> Barney boy. Uh, let's just a couple of other things, a couple of thank yous uh, before we get onto the show and we start the first cash game. Thank you to everybody that put your name in the comments. Um, you've all in here ready to have a game, but I also want to thank oh, Thomas Mark. Cook. You don't know about this, here, No, mate, no. Under here, Thomas Cook, his uh, lads' team is going to have a football uh, team. Something happened, um, and I think they're outgrown. So these are brand new. So he's sending these to me, and we're going to get some shorts and socks done. And Darts Minute TV are going to sponsor a football team this year. Oh, no, it's lovely. That'll That'll be good. really good. Yeah, Dad, one of my lovers is asking me if I have shaved. <laughs> Has he shaved? No, he's not <laughs> shaved yet, no. Me and yeah. Adam had a bit of a trim up before, didn't we? Yeah, yeah still... same moves with, yeah, with the lads. Yeah, you're still single and uh, he's going to be giving his number out tonight because we've actually got a phone in, so make sure you are ready because there is going to be, can I just grab them up, whoever gets it right and phone in first, we've got a mystery box oh. one and two up for grabs tonight. You're going to be able to chat on the show. Only one's I also be want under. to give you a sneak a uh, hint on what is in one of the next few boxes. There is a hot tub in one of the, and it, it's actually especially Dad's hot tub in one of these. So, is that one from one of your little Peppa the Pig setups? Yeah, Peppa Pig. You know, I love all Peppa that. Pig. I, I hate her. Peppa Pig. She's, she's horrible. She's yeah. horrible. Yeah. No so there. one of you is going to get your hand. So please be ready to call in the show as well. Just put them mystery boxes away. I think what we should do is now. You will see up on the screen very shortly um, that Adam is going to be giving somebody a game. Do you want to go up and let's see how you're throwing first? Okay, well, do you really? Really? Yeah, we'll all, we'll all go and have a little go and see throw. how we're all throwing. Let's Let's see. Wish me luck. Let's see how they're throwing. I certainly ain't going to be playing for cash tonight. And we've especially just recently turned the board as well, haven't we, Adam? Because obviously you've been peppered up the 20s. Nice steady 60 to start us off, look. A nice steady 25 to well, start us off. Do you need him in off. for a fiver? No. Liam Russell in for a fiver? John Lewis in for a couple of quid? Thank you so much. Absolutely awesome prizes tonight. We have got a fantastic show for you. If the camera freezes, please let us know straight away and we will address it. John Hazel Dan is saying, hi guys, how you doing? We're all great. Uh, looking forward to the week ahead, Adam. The weather is going to be absolutely Heat wave coming beautiful. this week, isn't it? Yeah. Charlie's asked me if I've been on the Xbox this week. I've actually been on the Nintendo. Dad, Mum and Dad recently bought us the Nintendo Switch. Yes, we've got it this week. So we've been back on Mario Kart, Ad. Oh, man, it's one of the best games ever made, isn't it? And there's actually, there's actually 40, um, there's 40 tracks on this one as well. 48, is that? Yeah, it's been absolutely awesome. Every night we've been playing, um, we've been playing like free, free circuits and everything. And Mum's always sitting there, and she always thinks that she's gonna get first. And then she always gets mad when she doesn't. And then 
Then we start telling her how to sort of win it, and then she's like, how do I do it? And how do I get the boosts? Yeah. Playing that simulacrum game. Oh, we're nearly a big plan. Thank you so much, Mark Dickinson. Um, William McNeil, thank you everybody at supporting us. Aim, Andy Danger Mouse, Rouse is in. Good evening. Hope you're all. Don't, Adam. What did you hit? <laughs> uh, just a 140. I did think I was going to get 180, that's why I started smiling and grinning, but not to be. I'll get one Daz, in a minute. Daz. Oh, I thought I was going to match it then, Adam. Nice little 81. Oh, steady up, mate. Steady in. Uh, Dwayne Pruitt is in. Uh, Dwayne is all the way from Canada, I think. Uh, extra two dollars for rotating the board. <laughs> uh, Mark the tornado is in with a well, well, Craig Smithy is saying, "Let's play darts." I hope that you are all ready. We're gonna I've also go... changed my throw, haven't I? Like my throw's a lot lower now compared to what it used to be. Yeah, you're doing really good, mate. Double top, double top. Yeah, heat wave coming, and my furlough's just come to an end. It's meant, to be, it's yeah. meant to be 29 on Sunday, Ad, so I'm going to be working outside in my Speedos. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much, Justin Oddle. Um, missed you too, Vicky. Mark Sin, thank you so much. And Billy Sutty rhymes with putty. Check him out for his images. Sent us a lovely, lovely um, mouse mat and some awesome key rings. Da Darren wants to give us a uh, Mario Kart game. He wants to get the Hamptons versus the Rangers. I'll guys. tell you what, I'll tell you what, what we should do is let us know if any of you guys have got the online Mario Kart ad and we could have like, a, a dark, because I'm actually called Darts Planet TV on there, we could actually right. have a race off. That would be really We've all got cool. a nickname, Dad's DPTV, I'm Mooch, Ellie is Ellie Mango, and Mum's Cripple. She wanted to be named <laughs> Cripple. I don't think she had any choice. Con have done that, no. but no, but we love doing all that sort no, of stuff anyway, said, don't no, we? Ellie, we went through an arse and she went, please, but i be named Cripple. Yeah. And then she chose the old... Oh, Stephen Passmore thinks that he is right. Um, was he correct with the two dark players? Everybody was wrong. He thought it was me and you, Ad. Uh, he was pretty much spot on. I think your dad's going to go to Q school soon. 85. Yeah, I think um, someone told me a horrible rumour there's a good chance there isn't going to be a Q school. There isn't going to be a Q school because yeah. what I've heard is Barry Hand don't think it's fair on the people, no, which is right, but I've got the tour cards because there, there's not going to be enough tournaments for them yeah. to keep their money in different bits. I was, I've, I've been sort of wondering about it, but I, maybe there'll be a Q school next summer or something. You are definitely going to the next one, whatever, Ad. Even yeah. Gav Connor Adam, how are you? Even to the gorgeous ladies Ellie and Laura. Can you know else? Hello. Dad. Maurice our... Starter has Mario Kart, Gav. He's in for a game with Ooh. you. Dad, in our game, uh, in our game, how many bounce ups did I have in in that in 14 legs? Oh, you had low, no, eleven. Yeah, you did. You had eleven, 11 bounce ups. But I think it's your throw because I think you throw very light, and they're, they're not the sharpest of darts. I don't to think they're bounce ups, right? Connor. They're more like the dart slapping the board. Wow. Get, we'll get Adam on the... Uh... Well, I'm hitting a 60 quite a bit tonight. I'm quite impressed with myself. Michael Tadman's in. Um, loads of people are in tonight. Absolutely awesome. Just before... Yes! Come on! <laughs> did, it, did it bounce out? <laughs> yeah. Guys, just before we go, a lot of people have joined us a bit later. I'll just show the uh, prizes again one, one more time. For Which time camera are we on? This one? Yeah, on that camera over there. Here we go. So... Go and show it this nice and close. First prize. Signed on the back, Ad. On the, the back. What I've noticed is... Bully boy, he's not actually that big. <laughs> is he? He's not as big as you think he is. No, he it's isn't. not that a huge shirt. But this is the Bully Boy Michael Smith shirt, and there you go, on the back. I don't know if you guys can see that, but he signed it on the back there. He's a good lad, Michael Smith, as well. He's a great player. It's a lovely shirt. He is. Uh, that's obviously the second prize, Dad. Even you don't know what is in there. No, I have no idea what's in here, but mystery box prize number two, worth over 40 quid. And last but not least, last but not least, don't forget to mention the quality players that play with those darts. Yes, so uh, I couldn't name you like a top top player, but <laughs> I do know uh, Mr. Rookyard is a big fan of these. And do you play these? Good darts? No, I don't play the overdrives. Um, you do like the blackouts, those guys. Yeah, like I said, blackouts. I love the blackouts. Um, I don't think I've reviewed those, have I? No, they are. Uh, Winmore have just sent them. Actually, I'm some exciting news. We have been sent some snipers. The blackout and also Red Dragon this week have been in contact and they are sending three new sets as well. Oh. And we've just had a massive delivery of L Style stuff. Cool. So L Style blackouts, win more stuff, and Red Dragon stuff coming soon. Okay, so right, and if you Guys, come and sit back down here. Something really weird has happened recently. I've kept the same darts for over two weeks. 
without changing anything. Obviously, I've changed the colour of the eight fights, but apart from that, I've not changed one thing. So I'm proud of myself for that. Okay, so what I think we should do now, without further ado, what we're going to do is we're going to put the pressure on you guys tonight. Now, you've all seen the rules who have signed up. We're going to give you three minutes to connect. We're on a live stream. We can't hang about. If you don't connect, we will have to move on to the next person. The prize cash board is over there. Yep. There's only one £50 jackpot up for grabs, but there's loads of 10s, 25s, and 15 pounds. So I think without further ado, Connor, if you actually add, why don't you pick out who's gonna be first? So um, everyone who went online earlier to the request, they put their names and I've written them down and I've put them in this lovely Dance Planet TV mug. And the first person who gets the chance to play for a few quid is gonna be Lawrence Kelman. AKA Kellers. Lawrence Kelman, congratulations. I'm now going to get you up on the stream. Adam, you, uh, well, I'll tell you what, we're, we're going to get spin wheel. Spin. Let's spin that wheel. Connor's bringing the wheel out. You get back up on the board. Me and Connor will get the wheel, bring it in shot, and let's see what uh, Lawrence Kelman is planning for. Spin that wheel, Connor. Okay. Kellers, <laughs> you're playing for. If he hits that jackpot, Connor, your Chinese is gone. I am only teasing you. Oh, wait, no. It's coming round, isn't it? It's coming round. It's got... 15, 15, 15 pounds. pounds. Lawrence Kelman, you are paying for 15 pounds. I am now going to invite you. Uh, just to confirm, that is that Adam Holder up to the camera. It's okay, over there, mate. If you can read my very childish writing. Let's Lawrence do Kelman's that. Kellers. As you can see, he's got it over there. We are now going to be inviting Kellers. There's also some bad news. I have got food beside me today, which is the Pringles, and so there probably will be a lot of choking. They're stinking, um, they're stinking out the room. They're so strong, the smell. Yeah. They are the best Pringles, though, aren't yeah. they? We are just waiting for Kellers to connect. Dan, why have I got such a handsome face? Because you're my son, and you've just got the looks from your dad. It's simple as that. Oh dear. I can't tell people what my nickname was at school, not live on stream. <laughs> Did it involve the word triangle? <clears throat> no, it didn't. It involved the word repellent. <laughs> um, <laughs> let's just see, we've got three minutes. Keep warming up, Dad. How are you feeling? Loosening the arm a little bit? Well, it's a little bit tight at the minute, but we're all right. We're not far away. Look, we're close-ish. I don't know what the guys can see at home, if they're seeing the board. Or yeah, they can see the board. And obviously, can you hear us, mate? Can you hear us? Just seeing if he can hear us while Adam's warming up. Ad, you'll have to speak to him in different bits and stuff. Oh, Kellers, are you there, mate? Let's see. Well, what we'll have to do is we can see his board. So if you go up for ball. Shall, um, we have a, shall I bull up? Yeah, so bull up. You know you do three darts on nine is darts, it mate. Three darts or bull? Three darts. What, so you what, count your closest one, is it? Yeah, count your closest one. We put all scores in. Bullseye then? Just leave that? No, yeah. you no you've got to carry on in case he get ball, 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 lad. Oh, okay. So what have you got, just, mate? Just the one bullseye, mate. No, wait, you, you say... Uh, and you, then a very small nine. So we've got, so we've got yeah. 50, zero, zero. 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 That's yeah. it, yeah. Oh, oh. Hello, Hello, mate. <laughs> We're just waiting for you to go up for ball, mate. <laughs> if you go up for bullseye... Live TV, eh? Well, that is the thing. It all depends on people's connections and everything as we do it. So let's just wait and see. Yes, he's gone up, Ad. We can see them. Nice. So is it, it looks in. like a self quarter throw first, yeah? It looks like it is. Just wait for him to put his scores in. Good luck, Lawrence. We wish you all the best, mate. Good luck, Ad. Let the force be with you. Me and Connor will do some of the comments that are coming through. Just wait for the um, score to come in. Just need the score to come in, Lawrence. If you can just put the score in, mate. Adam, if you get a nine darter, I might even think about giving you a I don't think a nine darter's coming, guys. So I've got really sticky hands as well. I've got cider on them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's thrown them again. Lawrence, we just need you to put your score in, mate. Right. Looking in the comments here. Yeah. Charlie. Hello, Charlie. How are you, buddy? Right. Shall I just go? Or we well, we can't. We can't because Lawrence hasn't put his score in. We need you to put your score in, Lawrence. If not, we're going to have to... Here we go. Here it comes. Is he now putting it in? He's put a... 
Oh, he's thrown at the... Oh, I what? don't know what's going on here. Not 25, here we go. 25, here we go. Where is? Right then. Okay, good luck. Come on in, Adam. Let's go for this. Oh, good start. 60. 60. Good start. Good start, Sam. Good Steady old straight arrows. Lawrence's uh, Wi-Fi is a little bit slow. That now, is the it? problem, isn't it? You know, around the UK, and that it all depends at the 30. moment. He started oh, with a 30. 30. Pick up 30. Let's have a look at some of the questions. Uh, Fraser Gunn, had a few enjoyable games on the Nexus earlier. Love how Darts for Net TV has allowed us to connect Ooh. through Darts. It's what we're all 40, about. Yeah. Just, just a 40, 40 yeah. Just, just a 40, 40 mate. 40. Um, it's very Neil's friendly, Darts, yeah. best using a laptop or computer for streaming, yet 100% agree. Uh, Charlie saying, let the force be with you, Adam. Obi Wan Kenobi. Evening, Dave. How you doing? Big match, this. 100. Go on. Good dart, Sam. Good dart. Go on. Go on. <laughs> yeah, Max has just come in mentioned in the 20s. Yes, Max. I, I, still, I still, it haunts me to this day, Max. Thank you, Luz, Richard Lusardi, for the 4.99. Oh. Uh, Hope Dennis you've had a nice time. bath this evening. Oh, dear. 45. 45. This is the moment where we tell you honestly 45. that when we do the reviews, we're here all night. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm only teasing. Kenneth has four cams frozen, by the experience. That's okay. It's fine. 55. Just got in with a... 55. Evening, Mark. How you doing? Craig Smithy, bloody internet. 59. I oh, know, it's not ideal, guys. We're doing all that we can. Keith Simmer, three quid. Thank you so much, mate. Love the stream, guys. Keep it up. That's Barney Boy Jr. Hope you're doing amazing. And thank you so much for that lovely photo that you sent me with your cap on. That's Barney's boy. Earlier, I heard someone mention about why isn't Adam and all them social distancing, but um, Adam was um, like the bubble in our bubble, so... He's, uh, he's visiting our house, so it's allowed. Oh, and also, so to be fair, the only thing that we are social distancing from uh, during quarantine is Dad's new iPad. <laughs> yes, yeah. everybody needs to... This cost about two grand. It's the one terabyte one. I don't like anybody near it. William McNeil is saying, Gav, we need a Dance Planet TV dance score now with Adam shouting the score. Yes. Ah, should we, can we do this? Of course we can. This would be can. really cool. Uh, I require 121. Charlie want enough, I'm going to be in the hot tub after the stream oh. tonight. After the stream tonight, I'm going to be in the hot tub. I've got a load of Desperados in the fridge. 81. And I'm going to be having a Chinese as well. How many darts did that double? No. no. Okay, Ad. So Keller's wants the big himself. one. The big one's 70 finished. Can he take the big fish out? Just no. make sure that Adam is the only thing stopping anyone from winning the prize. There's no pressure, says Dwayne Pruitt. Yeah. Right, Adam, you require 40. Oh, that's a marker and a half, isn't it? There we go. Boom! Congratulations, <laughs> Adam! If that is a mark, that is, that is a really, really good <laughs> marker. Right. Come back now. That is absolutely awesome. Brilliant, Ag. How was that for you? Just a little bit of a warm up, mate. Yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. That's the first time I've thrown my darts properly in. Um... Oh, are you feeling it? Well, not that much. <laughs> it's all right. It was all right. To be fair, um, like I say, I haven't, I haven't got a board at the minute at home, so the last time I threw any darts was last Sunday on the Nexus, wasn't it? So, yeah. So it was nice to get the steel tips out and actually have a game. So. Let's know in the, in the comments here, guys, anybody um, that thought that they knew who these uh, were earlier today. Like I said, because... Do you need to kick me in there on that side, don't you? Yeah, before I uh, reveal it... Someone wants me to, uh, to say on the darts app that you'll uh, hopefully be making for me to announce the winner. They say, and then comment on the darts app announcing to the winner player, you have won! <laughs> you, you could be the MC, <laughs> Don McDonald, to take over. So what we could almost do then is you could, like, I suppose, you know, you could call out on the app ad. Um, Connor could do that, and I could be, you know, the... 
maybe a pretty face for it all. Dad, what you should do, what you should do, is you should do something like, you should do two different ones, so you can do the professional one, and you can do sort of the fun one. So on the professional one, it'd be like 26, and the fun one would be like fish and chips. Yeah. And so you just got to go down like that, you'd have to do something funny like that, but, um... How do you fancy a cash game? I'm learning all this new stuff, Connor. Do you fancy a cash game tonight? Connor's going to go for a cash game tonight. So what we're going to do first of all is let's get that wheel out. Get the wheel out. I'll be on. I'll be on big pressure, and I really don't want to get the jackpot. So we're all hoping and praying. Shall I give it a spin then, Connor? Yeah. So do you want me to pull another name out of my little my little mug? Yeah, sure. Go on. This is where this is where someone's going to land the jackpot. Please don't get (laughs) someone good. Please. Who's going to land the jackpot? Right, I've pulled a name out. Uh, P Reynolds one eighty. P Reynolds one eighty. You are up. And um, can I spin the wheel, Connor? Yeah, go on. Go on, hit the jackpot. P Reynolds, <laughs> you have won yourself. Connor, still the pressure it. is on, son. Don't stop it. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. The pressure is on. This is it jackpot. This is going to be jackpot. I reckon this is going to be a 50 quid Oh my game. god, oh my god. I'm not even looking. Oh my god, we've missed it, we've missed it. Yes. Yes. Ten pounds. <laughs> Pete <laughs> Reynolds, you are going to be up You're against up, Connor. Connor for ten pounds. I was panicking. Back, Take the wheel back, Take Connor. Take the prize wheel. Let's see how he's going. Let Connor just have a little uh, bit of a practice, and me and Adam will answer a third of questions. Dad, so, yeah. Uh, just quickly, um, Vicky Ralph said, um, "Can you wish a happy Father's Day to Squibby and Bobby?" Happy Father's Day to Squibby and Bobby, or as I call them, SK or SQ, Wibbly Wobbly or whatever they are. Hope you're having a fantastic day and thank you for joining us. Didn't know whether we'd have any watch tonight being Father's Day. Yeah, Father's Day and another nice day and people out and about, but it's nice. I don't know how many have we got in at the moment, guys? No, actually we can't see because of this. How many are in, Ellie? Have we got a few in? Uh, We have 154 in. 154 in. So please share, make sure you hit the like button and have your phones at the ready to call in uh, to the show very soon to get a chance to win one of the mystery prizes. Thank you so much, uh, Karen Nicholson, uh, for your donation. Um, Really, really appreciate it. Loving the stream, love the mystery box. Really pleased the Happy Father's Day, guys. Uh, My mate Adam Whitaker is in. Adam Whitaker, you heard it here first, Japan, but not before Vegas, mate. Let's do it. Um, What other comments have we got coming in? Uh, Smithy's in, Andrew Kinsman, yes, we can't see the scoreboard properly at the moment. Um, do you mean on the telly there? We probably need to change the cameras a little bit, but we're calling the scores out anyway. Uh, just while we're on this ad, um, you know it's been a really exciting week for me. Uh, I've been here, there and everywhere and launching my all our very own brand of darts. Yes, the first ever set of Darts Planet TV darts are on their way, aren't they? With Zach Thornton. So yeah. a massive shout out to Zach. We've been working very closely. This week I went and see um, a packaging firm. It all looks really good. The darts are going to be amazing. They're all going to be engraved. Um, this is something that we spoke about probably a year ago, but even yeah. now I can't believe that it's... Oh, come on! Good boy! Uh, That's the... Uh, I was the, expecting them one eight. But, um, you know, uh, to, to, to be bringing them out... I'm, I'm not being funny, I think um, it's every kid's dream when you first start playing darts to see a set of your own darts being made, oh, isn't yeah, it? yeah, I oh, can't so believe it. So. Well, we're starting with the limited edition. There's going to be a hundred sets brought out of those ones. They will sell very quick. We're also going to bring a hundred out in soft tip. Then we're already working on South Pole 180s, and uh, me and They're Connor, of course, are going to be bringing our ones out. Uh, me being buzzing, the wasp, mine are going to be black and yellow. Well, the South Pole 180 ones, I have had a glimpse of those. Um, I mean, if you remember, a few months back, we did put out a couple of prototypes of what they might look like. The official finished South Pole 180s don't look like those, and no one's going to get to see them until they come out. So. Yeah, you know, and Zach's been amazing because Adam has actually been. Hello. Ice cream man's here. Huh? Ice cream man. The ice cream man. We can't get an ice cream not now, Lords. We're on the live stream. We'll just have to miss him tonight. <laughs> oh God. You can go and get one though. We have been go waiting. Get one, Every single night we've oh, been waiting for the ice cream man, right? Yeah, and he's not that. turned up. And he has now turned up in the stream. It happens, Lords. Just get some tubs and whack them in the freezer and we'll have them up. Would you want one? <laughs> I'm fine, thank you. Although I do yeah. like a whippy, but I'm... I'm get him a tub of whippy and, and stick, um, stick them all in there. I'm still trying to... I'm on a mission at the Dad, minute, guys. Ten for Adam to put the finger on the iPad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, no, God, God. no he's touch not it. going anywhere near the iPad, <laughs> are you, mate? Uh, yeah. 
So, uh, so yeah, we're very excited about that. Zach's been very, very thoughtful, um, you know, and he's gone backwards and forwards. It's been absolutely epic. So, let's move on to the next game. So, who did we pull out? P. Reynolds. Mr. Yes, Reynolds. Yes, sir. Let's Reynolds see how you're throwing, Connor. Let's do this. Uh, and obviously, Connor, you'll need to speak to him. Let's have a look. He's invited us on here as well. There we go. Massive thank you to everybody. Stephen Passmore's in. Charlie says he's been in touch with Zach on Twitter and making his own dance and hoping Zach will be making his dance too. Oh, nice. Charlie, that would be awesome. Are Charlie, they going to be a bit like the Glenn Durant ones, Charlie? I reckon they might be. They yeah, will be. They 100% <laughs> will be. Uh, do you want to have a chat, Cons? Hello, hello. Can you hear us, mate? All right, Connor. Well, I reckon we'll just have to go up the ball. So like what Adam do up, Connor. Do your bull up, mate. So what's, the, what's your favourite double, Gav? My favourite double is 16 to 8 now, whereas I used to like 10s. Yeah, I'm a tops and 10s, Zilch, man. zilch, zilch. But zero, I, zero, zero, but I, I do tend, Dad, I know this may oh. uh, surprise you a little bit, but I do tend to end up on double one a lot. Yeah, well, that does surprise me, to be honest. Because <laughs> um, you normally have to hit, like, a one to leave double one, so... <laughs> <laughs> so Peter, Peter Reynolds, I think it is, is up against Connor and he's got the darts. Good luck, Connor. Thank you. No pressure, Connor. Relax, enjoy it. This is your first money game of darts, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah good yeah, luck, yeah. Peter But we're getting him on the circuit next yeah. year. Actually, no, my first money game was getting Stan for that £30. Pounds. Oh, yes, of course, yeah. We're definitely going to be getting him. Got nice, clear sound with this Six. one as well. 60 Six. from Mr Reynolds there. Good little start. Good, steady, straight 60. Oh, dear. Just relax, Connor. Let them flow. Just relax, mate. Oh, 12. 30. 30. Shall I do a bit of calling? Yeah, go on, yeah, go on calling, you do guys. a bit of calling, Ad. Oh, Harry's in. Uh, so I bumped into Harry the other day when I was at work. Harry's definitely not six foot seven. <laughs> Is that Harry the book? He's not yeah. six foot seven. Did yeah. he add what, how many inches uh, on? He added a few inches on. Did he? Oh, he's in the treble here. Nice little stick. Richard Usardi, uh, he's 100 been. 100 from Mr. Reynolds there, it looks like. 100. Connor is throwing the Winmore Overdrive darts. We absolutely love them. Uh, oh 26 from Connor, but that's not bad. Don't mate. you that's worry, Connor. You're in this 26. area. If you're a beginner player and you're in there, it's fine. Uh, Ad, so who's your top three players? That's from Fraser Gunn. My top three favourite dart players of all time. Well, Eric Bristow would definitely be in there. Yeah. Um, Phil Taylor would definitely be in there. What about and Jockey Wilson? Is your Jockey Wilson fan? I was, he was like, to be honest with you, mate, I'm not as old as I look. He was a bit before my time, really. I mean, Jockey was sort of very much, very much, I think I only ever saw him play on TV a couple 81. of times. 81. Um, but this one's going to surprise a lot of people and think a bit weird, but I, can, I was actually thinking about this in the garden the other day. What was you doing in the garden? Just laying Well, I was looking at cutting the lawn, but didn't. <laughs> um, but the first ever... The first time I ever picked up a set of darts, and my mum and dad had a dartboard in the kitchen, so my mum and dad both used to play county darts. Six. Yeah. And the BDO World Championships were on telly, and there was a left-handed Scottish guy called Les Wallace playing. Oh, I remember Les Wallace. He right. was brilliant. Yeah. And I, I literally him. walked into the kitchen and just started like mimicking how he threw darts, because he was left-handed as well. And I, my dad walked through and was like, oh, blooming hell, you're not too bad. And then started playing... I was only about 11 or 12, I suppose. And yeah, so Les Wallace is going to be one of my favourites because he was the one that got me playing. Yeah, absolutely oh, quality God. player. Don't worry, Connor, just relax. You're all right. Just the eight, eight. Connor. Connor, it doesn't so matter, mate. I was, I was hitting before the game. <laughs> like... For those that can't see, uh, Mr. Reynolds wants 196 here, so he's going to be trying to set it up somehow. He's, ah. he's got 65 there so far. 85, so he's left himself 111. 85. So kind of one big score here and you're back in this. That's 40. straight though, mate. 40, 40. Connor. Well oh, done, pal. So, oh, treble 20 will be the first dart here. <laughs> oh, we're saying, is that a five? It's a five. So he'll stay up there. Oh, just a 29, Connor. So again, one big score here, and you're just going to... Come on, Connor, up. just relax, mate. I've told you, pal. It doesn't matter. Look how bad your dad is on here. Uh, 43. 43. It's all about learning, pal. I'm proud of you. 43. Ben Martin's in with £2. Thank you so much. Jim Needle is saying he's beaten uh, Liz Wallace in the pub league. Oh. 
Uh, Fraser also know him. Is Connor still fine with the overdrives? If so, how are they to throw Connor Ben? What I really like the overdrives. Uh, that they, they throw so straight. So I'll definitely recommend <coughs> using the overdrives. So uh, <coughs> Mr. Reynolds has left himself 32. So a quick 140 here, Connor. It's a game changer. Well, that's unlucky. So what you got there? 27. 27. So double 16 now for the match and for 10 pounds. <laughs> the big 10 bucks. We can see it. Oh, he's double double maybe. Oh, right. he's missed Connor, it. Go on, Connor. Connor. This is where 140 will really change this game. 16. 55. 55. Good lead, mate. Lawrence Kelman is in with five pounds. Thank you so much, Lawrence. Willie McNeil is saying, just relax, Connor. Take your time. Oh, well You're all good. Game's up. Congratulations. Uh, come over okay. here, Connor. Let's talk about it. Well Shots done, mate. I think I, I did play horrible there, just uh, to be fair. I was hitting before the game, like 100... Uh, I hit 120 tops, tops, tops. But listen, everybody knows yeah. you can do it. You look, how, you look how much I struggle. I've been throwing them out the board and then we come off. It's all in the head, mate. Yeah. You're young, respect to you. You're proud of them, haven't we, Ad? Yeah, oh, well, well, let's look at it realistically. A few months ago, you'd never even thrown a dart. So yeah, exactly. Lovely, mate. So what we want to do now is let's, uh, before you go on and do your next game, Ad, I, I'm just going to put this up for everybody to see here. Bear with me a I've minute. I've still only seen one person in the comments get it right. So let me know in the comments. We are about to reveal, reveal who the winner is. Let us know in the comments, any last people, um, any last guesses before we reveal the winner. And I do believe that the winner is also in the stream ad. Because you don't know who the winner is. No, I don't know. So that Who's is really, really cool. I will show you. I'm going to hold this up. Do not say who it is. Ah, The winner really? is watching the stream tonight. Dad, you know they, could, they just saw it on... I'm sure be reading it. <laughs> <laughs> they probably wouldn't see it over there. Uh, let's no, have a look. Saw it on, on the actual... Peter Reynolds has said, thanks to the game, Connor. I was nervous um, throwing. I was on stream. Exactly. It really is difficult. So let's have a look here. And I will get this ready in a minute. And we will all see... Connell Coleman, you've got one out of two there in your little comments. In a minute, it is going to be revealed and we are going to showcase who the winner is. Uh, Wolfie and Barney says Stuart Hall. Um, Connor tends to start walking early on his last start. That's I reckon he'd get more consistent. If That's a habit that 90% of... Is that a habit that... It's a people? habit that I would say 90% of... Um, how would you word it? Um, amateur dart players do. They yeah. all do it. Everyone does it. It's not just Connor. I do it all the time. Um, it's, um, well, John Anderson does it for a start. Um, it's Rocking all over the office. He rocks yeah, anyway, yeah. but I mean, on his last day he'll walk. Um, it's just one thing. Just And then, to be honest with you, um, if you start, if all you're thinking about when you're throwing is your last start and in your head you're thinking, don't walk on it, you're not concentrating on throwing yeah. the ball. Yeah. So it's, it's just a bad habit that will go. But don't think about it. I think yeah, the biggest it, problem yeah. that I've got at the moment is, like I said, and I can talk to you about it, and, you know, I'm not as bad off, offline as what I am, but I think the problem I've got is, is when I play online now, it's like, first of all, it's like, don't rush, you know, aim more, um, don't walk on the last start, just try and stay in the 20, and I've got all these things going on, but I can't actually just throw the dark line. Darts is one of the easiest games to play made hard by the person throwing the dart. You've yeah. just made it harder for yourself because you've just listed seven or eight different things that yeah. you're thinking about before you've even thought about throwing it at a 20. Yeah. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, that is. Yeah. <laughs> it is. And that's all the time. Yeah. But I think it's not getting easier. I think it's getting harder for me. Whereas, yeah. you know, I'm, I'm happy, go lucky. I always, I'm quite happy to make fun right. of myself anyway. So I don't care whether I, I hit my right ball. But it's more frustrating yeah. more than anything. Me personally as a dart player, I know... If I'm playing badly or not in form or really struggling, the reason I... It's not necessarily my scores where I know it. 
it's because I start thinking about what I'm yeah. doing as opposed to just throwing. Well, I've seen, you know, I can say this, like, I've seen it, haven't I? I've been to competitions and seen you play, yeah. and you've lost to players without mentioning that, that you should never have lost to, and you've been yeah. on fire beforehand, haven't yeah. you? Yeah. And you're really frustrated. And, yeah. and then you'll play somebody in a, in a different league on, you know, or on a county, and you play really well, don't yeah, you? Yeah, I mean, like, I saw someone put in their what's, what's your averages and things. Well, they vary. I mean, I, I've had... 30 plus averages and then I've had like one day averages and then I've had complete rubbish averages. It's all in a day really. It is. So are we ready um, to reveal who those two players were? Here we go guys. We've got a, one more but Lewis has come in there. That is who the two players were. It was Smithy, Dennis Smith and of course Big Cliff, Cliff Lazarenko. So many guesses. It took two days. The prize was meant to be given away yesterday. And we have got our winner. Let's just see if anybody, especially as the winner is in, is now going to say anything um, on there in the actual comments. Because it's obviously just been revealed. There we go. There it's you go. Now. Yeah, you can see it now. Paul Hall, Dennis Smith and Big Cliff Lazarenko. I would have thought that, I thought that Smithy would have been the easier of the two because I didn't like... Um, you know, blur him out as much. Mm. Uh, so that one really surprised me. I find it harder to play when you've been playing well is there is more pressure to keep the same. So, yeah, I'll agree with that as well. Like, if you are playing well in form, you've got to almost not think about that either because then you put too much pressure on yourself to play well. I've had that where, like, I don't know, on a Friday night local league down the pub, I've, I've beat someone with a, like a 12 and a 15 dart leg or something. Everyone's gone, oh, it's amazing. Come Super League or County on the weekend. I, I've expected that to happen again, and it doesn't work like that. You've got to, you know, so. Okay, so let's announce the winner. Here we go. You'll now see it on your screen. The winner, who was the first person to guess them both right, was Lawrence Kelman. You are the winner. Congratulations of this box, as you can see here. I've even written your name on it, Lawrence. The day this... Sailor's coming to the coin, so even... I oh, know. It's it's his mate. Mate. He's <laughs> there you go, Lawrence. It's all written out. You can see it here. This bad boy's going to be on its way to you. There is over £50 worth of stuff there to see, um, that's going to be sent. Do you know what's in it, Connor? I don't. You haven't told me yet, so... I don't tell anybody. Not no, even I don't own. know where anything's in it. So, anyway. well done, Lawrence Cameron. And keep an eye out. We've got some more of these coming. Um, the bargain boxes and mystery boxes seem... Uh, to be lots of fun. Uh, what we're also going to do is we're now going to go on to um, go on to the next game, Matt. You're going to be up for that in a minute. Else, Let's draw out somebody else, and then we will be getting. Uh, so uh, I'll go in my little uh, Dutch PTV mug, and Mr. Burke. Mr. Burke, let's see if Mr. Patrick Burke has Burke. invited us. He's on live darts as Burke Paired, I think. We just need to check that Patrick has invited us. I'm just having a look on here now. Shall I make my way to the board? Patrick Burke has. Go on, Ad. Over to the board, Excuse mate. Me, I'll tell you what, but what me and Connor are going to do is we are going to spin that wheel. And let's Patrick. see what Patrick is playing for. You're playing for... Are you coming to next to Dad? Yeah, because I just love you so much. It's mm. Father's Day. Oh. It's so tired. My, oh. my handsome, beautiful model of a dad. Oh, thank you, pal. Patrick. Here we go. The jackpot's coming around. You're I'll tell you what, playing. that's not going to be far out. It's not going to be far... Oh. oh. £10. Patrick, you are going to be playing for £10. Let's move this over and see how Adam is playing. Adam, it is over to you. I'm now about to click on to Patrick Burke, mate. Uh, shall I have three more then go for the bullseyes, see if he's on? Have three more and then go for the bullseyes. We've got three minutes for Patrick to connect as well. Oh, Let's have a look at some of them. Um, well done to Lawrence, says Tom Cook. Rob Bryson says, don't know who the bottom one, uh, still don't know who the bottom one is now it's revealed. Do you not remember uh, Cliff Lazarenko, big Cliff, absolutely awesome player. Lawrence Kelman's absolutely chuffed, saying brilliant, thanks guys. Barney's saying well done and loads of congratulations. Connell's asking when the phone in will be. It will be in between this next game and the next one. Lewis Colt is saying, make sure you wrap that box up. You've written 50p quid. Don't worry, mate, we're all over that. That will all be wrapped in the proper mailing bag and everything. <laughs> I like that, but the postman wouldn't need to add. 
I'll tell you what, I think there is a few postmen that have uh, had a fur of our bits over, <laughs> yes, they have. over time. We've had a few things going missing, haven't we? Yeah, so. I've got about five or six recorded bits going missing as well at the minute. Uh, Craig Smith is saying, where is Ellie sitting? Ellie is sitting just in the room over there. Ellie, just come and say hi so everybody can quickly see that you are in tonight. That I'm still alive. And Ellie's doing the raffle. Uh, Ad, just go through the prizes again. We've got loads of uh, late cameras. Wait, what camera is it? Oh, don't want to miss out. on the board cam now, Ellie. Board cam. Oh, on that one, Ellie. What one? That one there. Hi. Right there. Yeah. Right, right Ellie. Ellie in, is doing all the raffle. Ellie in the reverse order, a set of soft tip, blackout, win more darts. Nice darts. Apparently some amateur dart player plays with those. Yes. Yeah, Prize easy. number two, 40 plus quid's worth in another mystery box. <laughs> There's another one. And then prize numero uno is Mr. Bully Boy, Michael Smith, signed shirt, right there. So, that's a good one to win. There we go. And we are on a countdown, so we're still just waiting. I know it can take up to a couple of minutes to connect, so we're not gonna be going off Patrick, so try uh, not to worry, mate, just yet. Uh, Dynamite Dave is in, love Big Cliff. He was a real um, gent of the game, yeah, he certainly was. Um, I think he could also drink as well, couldn't he, Ed? So I've, I've, heard. I've seen it in person. I wasn't very old. I wasn't much older than Connor, and I was, I was amazed at what I was seeing. <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't uh, drink fizzy pop and rye beaners like that man was drinking wine and other things. Craig Smith is saying, hi Ellie, she is to control boobs, yeah, she certainly is. Dwayne Pruitt is saying, I don't know if he's on about your hair or Ellie's, but he's saying your hair's looking, oh, your hair is looking great actually. Oh, yeah. I think it's mine, isn't it? I've had a, I've had a little trim up, haven't I, so. Certainly have. For my Tinder. Exactly. <laughs> Let's have a look. I don't know, but Patrick, he's got one minute left. He's if running not, out of time, We're going to move on to, yeah, we're going to move on to the next player. Neil Fitchy Fitch is in with five pounds. Lewis Colt is in with five pounds. Adam, what dance do you use? That is from Guna Harry. Guna Harry, the dance, would you like to see? I'll tell you what, Guna Harry, I'll show you it at the camera. And then if you can actually guess what they are, should we do that? Because not many people don't know what these are. And if they do, we'll send them a little tiny something. Yeah, I'll tell you what, let's send them a, let's send them a t-shirt. Put your, put your okay. comments in there. So, and then we'll reveal it in about 10 minutes time, what I do. I've played with these for about a year now, I suppose. So, can you see them? Are they showing up on there, guys? They are showing up beautiful and, yeah, nice and there shiny. Cool. Nice okay, and shiny. So the Notice not many grouping marks. The person playing Adam, since Patrick, it's not working. We're going to have to go off this in a minute. Just while we're on there, Adam Gorfrop, or Gorfrop, he won the bargain box, I believe, this week with the uh, £108. Was it Adam, wasn't it? Oh, did, uh, did, did you win, Adam? I think it was Adam that won the £108, had the demolition darts in. Chris Bates is in with a fiver. Keep up the good work. Stuart Hall, did you get a reply from John Park for me? Stuart has not replied to me yet. I have sent him a message asking about the shirt, and as soon as I know, I will let you go. Um, Max, great luck. Just I just got at home. Max, I'll tell you what, it is the power of the TPTV army. And I've just seen a result come in. Thomas Howland has just lost 4-1 to Dave Francis in the uh, Nexus Dark Public TV tournament. So Dave won, did he? Yeah, wow. he said that he was absolutely relentless. Gaz Stevens is in with £4. Dan Collage is in with £2. I think he's working, maybe not working too hard. And Rob Brighton is in saying he loves to look at the blackout darts. The they person playing Adam is Weeble. So we are now going to have to go off here, guys, and wait a minute. I'm just Lee. looking in the comments for my still tip dance. Uh, we have, out of all the comments, we've got one person who is right. Uh, congratulations, Weeble. Connor just picked you out. We need to move on with the game, so be ready, and you're playing. Connor, can you just write down this name for me? Has somebody got it right? Yeah. Ellie will write it down. Just uh, Ellie the Raffler. Ellie, can you write down Gerard Houston's oh, name? Oh, Weasel's on. How you doing, mate? Right. Uh, we have, out of all the comments we've got, one person who is right. Uh, congratulations, Weasel. Connor, just picked you out. We need to move on with the game, so be ready. And you're you might just right need to um, turn the stream off, mate, right. because you're about a minute behind. Okay, right How are you, mate? Good, how are you? Yeah, really good. You're on the live stream, mate. The last person couldn't connect, so you're in. You're playing for a tenner. Uh, thank you for all the artwork and everything that you send us, mate. It's always awesome. Uh, 
That's all right, mate. It's always something to do while we're doing nothing else. Absolutely love it. Can't wait to meet you after lockdown. Um, you're on against Ad. Good luck, mate. You're going up for ball. Me first. Yeah, you go yeah, for ball for first, mate. mate. Good luck. Are you able to put once you've done this the camera on the board or is it just to be on you, Paul? 225 is good. Is he? Right. Hang on. Ah, need a ball, don't I? Nothing. Zero, zero, zero. Uh, very good, Dart and family are the horse. You've got Paul, Kieran, and Harley. All very, very good Dart players. Helmy is in with five pounds. Thank you very much. Yeah, loads of G-Force down fit. Is that what they are? Right? They are a G-Force down fitting dart. Yeah, 20 grams. Yeah, but uh, I, I think Ellie won't name the name of the lad that got it first. So we're just waiting for... I'm trying to turn the camera down. Yeah, you're all right, mate. Don't worry about it. That's absolutely fine. We've got your connection. We've got a good connection with you, mate. You're only down the road, aren't you? All right, I'll try and turn this one around. Looking forward to seeing you again, Gavin, after the lockdown. Same here, Charlie. Cannot wait to catch up with you. Uh, don't know what was waiting on my side. Nothing happening. It was connected here, um, Patrick. It just didn't work. Are you all going to uh, Minehead next uh, in March for the UK Open? Yeah, probably will do. Come on, Weeble! I should just say, if people are using their phones, make sure to um, go on live dance via Google Chrome. Yeah, that makes a big, big difference. Not Safari. Has it just blacked out, is it, mate? You'll have to answer a few questions, Ad, just while Shall we have a look? What have we got? Peter and Harley knocked me out of the steels. Harley knocked to Pete Reynolds. He's talking about Harley being a very good player. I know Harley. Harley's um, come to watch, no, used to come watch me play yeah. county and stuff. You what, mate? Is that in front yet? No, not yet. We can't see. We've only got a black screen, buddy. We can't see you anymore. We can't see your camera at all. It's just black. Oh. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, go on, Ad, you throw for ball. You throw, you no, it's he's won the ball. Oh, there you go, we've got it now. We're winning. So, so wait a minute, let's do so that. I've got zero, zero, zero. Weeble to throw first. Go on, mate. Good Best luck, Weeble. Water. Game on. No pressure. Double. Double top, double top is in with five pounds. Thank you so much, Jim Needle. I want to go. Um, a bit sad going on. Oh no! All right, he's off now. Jim, you meet up with us. We've got a huge army there. Fifty-eight. Sixty. What did you get, Ad? Fifty-eight. Chris Littlewood. Yeah, we can do it all again, mate. We can have a few more beers. We can have a rematch on the soft tip. Uh, Dynamite Dave, UK Open, book it, paid it, see you all there, it's his church, he loves it, thank you for joining the stream this evening. Stephen's in, I'm going to UK Open in March, Gavin TV, DC TV Army. I'll tell you what, how cool would it be when we go there and there's loads and loads and loads of people when the TV TV Army stuff? One hundred and eighty! <laughs> Boom! <laughs> 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 oh, lad, I can't believe you've done that. <laughs> uh, UK Open is my favourite weekend of the year. Nick, I will meet you there as well. Can't wait to meet you and your husband. Should be good fun. Um, Smithy, might as well. Kept off the camera. <laughs> I missed that one. Oh, 43. That's what you got to do Back after down one to Earth. That's what you got to do after one uh, Stephen Pippen, yeah. Eight 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 loads of us going to Minehead. Yeah, hundred and go tops, tops, tops. <laughs> so, yeah, Jamie Donner is saying he'll be at Minehead too. Looks like Winter Gardens tickets will roll over to next year. Always want to do a pro tour event in Germany, oh, um, and could get a TP TV coach and mini holiday. That would be awesome. I've only hit the trebles in one throw. Forty three, go. I keep telling Adam uh, what he uh, needs to like leave himself uh, <laughs> for the wins. So I keep telling him. Uh, 
all his checkouts and stuff. <laughs> Uh, Stephen Urch is going to be in mine head is saying he's going to be packing his DBTV Army t-shirts a lot of people will actually have their six month loyalty t-shirts by then well a lot of people are getting them this month oh dear you can tell I'm rusty 95 Gav 95 well done you can, you can do 82 I don't mind an 82 Gav yeah, you'll have to 20 double 16 I'll just go bullseye double 16 Adam Whitaker's right. saying we're going to have to bring out a limited edition UK Open Darts on a TV t-shirt. That would be awesome. Right, 82, yeah? Go on, Ad. 25, 17 for tops. Oh, I've missed the 17. Tops left, Gav, 42. Congratulations, Ad. The only way you can go tops is double 10, double 10. We will no, we 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 take this out. He could take one, four, five out here. Right, tops. Marker again, look. 150. Oh, oh you missed Swedish. it. Unlucky. Uh, Mister, what's this for a tenner? This is for a tenner. How many did you miss at a double three? All of them. Yeah. yeah, double 15. Just wanted to rub it in a little bit. <laughs> Craig Smithy saying he's banned from mine, Ed. And Alan Aldridge just saying I met him up there before. Oh, he looks like he's got a big 15 there. Oh, cheers, Max. For DPTV, Tawny's on better than them all. Game shot. Well done, Ad. And the match. Unlucky, Paul. You played Swear well there, mate. Cheers, Paul. Thank you, mate. You played really well. Take care, mate, and I'll speak to you soon. Game shot and the match. Yeah. Cheers, buddy. Cheers, cheers mate. Man. Take care. Bye. Do you have a little pack? Like, just some, a throw around, Dad. For the next game or not? We can do. Have, why don't you two guys have a throw around and show them what it's all about? And I'll, I'll probably comments. have a throw around. You can read some comments. What we want to do is, we don't want to take everybody's time tonight because it's Father's Day. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do is, we have got a call in. Now, in a minute, I am going to be putting a picture up on the screen. Now, Ad, if you could bring out their mystery boxes over there, you can hold them up to the camera. Mystery box one We've and two. two boxes here, number one and two. The caller who comes in, all you've got to do is call in the show, tell us who the players are, um, and then after that, uh, you can pick a mystery box. Like I say, these two don't know what's in them. They're good little prizes. Um, and Connor's going to be putting his number Just up in a minute. Just I'm sure where my phone is, because it was... You were sitting on it. Where what? is Connor's phone? It was on charge behind me, Connor. Um, what sort of, have you got any clues for what might be in one of them? Mm. Is one a lot better than the other, Gav, or...? I would uh, I would say, one's definitely got more value. One of the boxes has got more value than the others. We obviously won't open the second one anyway, so they're only going to see. Have you lost your phone, have you, Connor? It was right <laughs> so we've there. got this number and everything was, ready. Connor's phone was on charge right it here. It was right here. What have you done with it? You tell... Oh, here it is. <laughs> there you go. Got it. It's actually on the table. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're now going to put this up on the screen. Connor, take yes. your phone off Do Not Disturb Ready. The first caller will have a little bit of a chat to you, um, find out a little bit about you, and you're going to get a chance. Okay. So let's get... <laughs> this here, bear with me one second. We didn't get many comments for my 180, did we? Come on, guys. Damn no. this. Yeah, that is absolutely incredible. That is you to a T. Uh, so all you need to do, guys, as you can see on the screen now, um, over there, you've just got to name who the two players are. It's very easy. I've not blurred them out too much because I didn't want this to be here for 48 hours. Well, I'll tell you what. I think, I think, um, I was going to say, I didn't think it'd take long for the phone to ring on that. Here we go. Hello. Hello. Hello, who's calling? Dave, how are you, mate? How are we doing? Oh, good, mate. I see that you went through in an epic game against Thomas Howland in the uh, Nexus tournament. Oh, I did, yeah. I managed to get a 4-1 in it. I'm a 1-1-5-1-7-4 average. I played that one, to be fair. Oh, that's incredible, mate. You've been hiding from me, Dave. We haven't had a game for a while, mate. Oh, no. I know. It's, it's, it's one of those things. That I, I don't know what happened last week with the... Um, it is hit and miss still, isn't it, the Nexus? To be fair, there's some, you know, I did an update, as you know, last week, and we was on the most up-to-date one, but nobody seemed to be able to connect to us. Yeah, it's strange, because the way the lobby is, you, you 
you're not always all we're, we're not always in the lobby together, but you go to your favours and there's one that you're in by. But from the lobby it will, but then you go to the lobby and it doesn't show you. It no, doesn't show the person, it, does it? No, no, it doesn't, no. And there's also, I think they've had issues with the favourites, by the way. If you add somebody as a favourite, I think that has been an issue on some of the software updates I think as well. quite a lot of people in the comments last week said, because they'd gone to favourites for us, that was them that couldn't get through to us, but the guys that saw us in the lobby could get through to us. But then, like I said, there were some people who couldn't see us in the lobby as well, weren't there? Yeah. But guys, yeah. anyone who doesn't know Dave... Oh, sorry, Dave, go on, mate. Because I was going to say, at the same time, do they really expect that many people to get Nexus scissors at the same time it, with Target. I think we've got to sort of better with them a little bit as well to get these servers right. Yeah, I, and I think the army's growing. I think, like, when we go on, like, if you go on just after the show, like, 20 minutes, there's hardly anybody on there. I think at Dance Planet TV, we've tried to do something very, very different. It's all about you guys. I see that you were featured in, in this month's magazine. I might even hold it up now, Dave, and actually show people live. Uh, let's just see. There he is. Look, Dave Francis in all his glory right at the back there as, as one of the fans. Um... In the magazine, we include you guys. It's all about you guys. Without you, we've got nothing. No, nah, it's brilliant, mate. For what you do for us, you know what I mean? Especially this time as well, when a lot of people are struggling to do things. The whole Nexus community, the Dark Planet TV community, it's not just all sort together. That's because that's of you guys. That's nothing to do with us, mate. That's because of you. Yeah, thank you so much. I obviously met you for the first time at the uh, JBD Fishing last year as well, didn't I? Look forward to the next get-together that, that we have, mate. Yeah. Know, obviously, for us lot, we all feel like we, we all know you because we see you every week on the TV, so, yeah, it's great. It is. I can't wait. I think the, the VIP meet-up, like Connor, you know, we're all so excited. Ellie's going to come along, Laura, Adam. It's going to be massive, and we're growing all the while. Believe it or not, there's nearly 350 VIP members now, which is, which is quite incredible, really. That's bad, yeah. mate. Um, Guys, um, all the accolades deserve to you for, for what he's done, but you know, on, on the other side of it, as fans, we've been trying to read the rewards, it's brilliant. All these tournaments and everything else you're doing, it's fantastic. Thank you. And the, the, the new stats, when we get them all implemented, Barney's been absolutely amazing, Sam do the write ups. Um, it's going to be incredible. It's taken, I'm not going to lie, it's taken us longer than what we wanted uh, to, to build these player profiles. But when they're done, you've had a sneak peek, they're good, isn't they, Ad? Yes, brilliant, mate. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can really imagine they are. Now, I've got my personalised T-shirt that's just turned up. So that's going on the phone with me with you tomorrow. To get that sent over. Fantastic. The quality's brilliant. Well, uh, Ad, it's over to you. Uh, to you, Dave. Do you fancy winning a prize, mate? I'd love to, mate. Please. Right, Dave. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Well, he can't I, guess you. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Who are those people in the old pictures there, then, Dave? What, what the old pictures? That was Smithy and Lazarenko. Yeah, no, the new the one. The new ones. Have now. you seen the new ones? Because of the delay, I better come outside. There you go. I'll tell you what. I'll put them back up on the screen. You're going to get them. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, I'll put them back up on the screen. Yeah, You're not throwing Red Dragon defenders, are you, Adam? No, I'm just reading some of the comments. People snooze you lose, guys, I suppose. Don't worry, Dave. I've not blurred them out too much. It should be a nice, easy one for you to get your hands on one of these mystery boxes. Oh, great. Here we go. Come on, Dave. You, you, met, you met them both, I think. Yeah, I'm sure I have. <laughs> <laughs> Who are they, Dave? You're live. There's no pressure. Is that second one, Mason? Yeah. Uh, I'm not having one with that. Correct. <laughs> oh, you, <laughs> you have got them and you phoned in uh, really quick. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back now. Now, Adam is holding up mystery box one and mystery box two. Um, one what, is slightly heavier than the other, Dave. Uh, no, you want to go for mystery box one? Shall I undo mystery yeah, box no, one? No, let's, un let's undo it. Shake the whole box. Shake down. the whole box. I'll tell you what, let's not undo it. I will send it to you, Dave, because it's even more suspense uh, for the people. And you can actually um, then share it on Twitter. It's absolutely loaded with goodies, this one. You've got the better one of the two. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. Well, I'm fine with that as well. Fantastic. Thank you. 
No, no worries at all, mate. Thank you so much for your support and calling in to the uh, show and everything. It means the, means the world to us. And you stay safe and, and we'll catch you all very soon, mate. Yeah, all the best to you guys. Stay safe yourself. Thank and you. mate, you take care. Cheers, Dave. Bye now. Bye. Bye. There you go. Go and hand it over to Ellie. So that's another prize on the way to Ellie. Uh, Connor's going to put that on Do Not Disturb. Like I say, at the end of the show, we're not done yet. We have got this awesome... Um, pure innocence goodies worth between four and five hundred quid. Laura is going to be um, coming in and uh, telling us a little bit about those ones. Yep. Uh, Connor's going to go back up on the dartboard and have a quick chuck, and we will answer a few of your questions. How you throwing, Connor? How's your luck? Horrible. Did you see the big donation, Dad? No, I'm now going to have a look. Is there a big donation coming? I'm Aldridge. Let's have a look. There we go. Let's have a look. Connor's having a throw there now. Yep. Oh, thank you so much, Alan Aldrich. In with £25. And like I say, thank you for Dave for calling into the show. Uh, got his hands on a fantastic prize. Do not forget, Connor's going to hold up the prizes for those of you that are late this evening. Uh, so, not signed. Us. Bully Boy T-shirt. Dark shirt. Yeah. <laughs> There's a signature on the back. Uh, mystery box up for grabs there. Mystery box. 40 quiz. Hey, I'm, good at, I'm good at modelling all this stuff, isn't it? You certainly are. Who's black donation darts. in there from Alan if, Aldridge? I, I, I've said this, but if I actually had to rank darts, I'd put these overdrives at number one for me, and I'd put them blackouts at number two. I like them a lot. Go ahead. Yeah, I had to just nip away for a second there. Why what black... that then, Ed? I think the, the cider went through me a little bit too quickly there, so... Yeah. I'll tell you what, you've seemed a little bit tipsy, I don't know, are you? <laughs> are you? You can answer a few <laughs> questions, Ad. Uh, Paul's just coming, well done for the game, Adam, Thank, uh, thanks for the game. Uh, did anyone get stuck? Yes, there was a young lad, I forgot his name now, but Ellie's written it down, he was the first one to get it. They're a set of uh, the Very old, decent. old, old uh, Daryl Fit and G-Force darts, they were. Uh, just looking at a few of the other comments. Um, Oh, uh, Andy Danger Mouse Rouse is in. Well done, Dave, mate. Yes. Andy Danger Mouse Rouse, lovely, lovely family. Yeah. Huge supporters of the channel. Few people asking how do they win these prizes, Gav. So do you want to explain that whilst you're throwing actually all the I'll different ways? I'll tell you ways? what, Ad, you're one of my right-hand men. You can tell them all about it. <laughs> so obviously we do loads and loads of giveaways on Twitter. Obviously loads of giveaways in the, on uh, the live streams. For example, today, if you want to enter the draws to win those prizes that Connor just showed you, you simply, for every pound you donate, is a ticket in a raffle. So one pound gives you one ticket. Obviously, ten pounds gives you ten tickets. It's up to you what you put in, but only put in what you can afford. So if you've only got a couple of quid, put in a couple of quid. And oh, which is going to hit 140 then? Connor's hitting a lot of treble 20s first start with these. Plum centre two, he is. He's always He's playing really well. Trailer. We're getting ready for Japan, Ad. Yes, mate, yeah. That's going to be Unfortunately, brilliant. Unfortunately, I'm not going. So, obviously, um, I was talking I'll about... I'll tell you what, that's two 100s in a row for me, Ad. You, like you, see tailors, that, you yeah. don't see that, bro. Yeah, I do like these tailors. They're yeah. good. Craig C has just joined. What has he missed? Well, Craig. I'm down 100 with you. You've missed uh, Connor losing a game of darts and me winning a game of darts. Yeah, well done, right. Tony. Tony's put the number up to stop all the people saying they didn't see the number. Um, there you go, guys. There's the number. Save it in your phones for next Save time. Save it in your phones, Save yeah. Save it in your phones for next time. Pass the finger and all that. Anyone who knows me knows I'm, I'm not a big fan of salt. Tell you what, guys, so it is hard being salting. famous. It's very hard being It is. Stuart Hall. Oh, and also, if there's any young ladies watching this, the number, Connor is single. <laughs> yes. I mean, uh, I am a very dapper, handsome, kind. Yeah. I'm a gentleman, aren't I, Adam? Yes, he's, uh, he's everything I'm not. I'll so. tell you what, we're going to give somebody a really easy chance to win now, because I'm going to get on the dark It's Gav coming on the board. So it's going to be guaranteed. Uh, Come on, Jackpot. Gonna win. If the jackpot comes out, I am not playing the jackpot. It will move over to Ad. He's the only one that can play the jackpot prize. Gerard Houston, there we go. Well done, mate. So, Gerard Houston, if you um, leave your details on there, where's it, Gav? Send a message to Darts Pat TV on Twitter. It's, 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 it's always best to send it through the actual website. If you go to okay. www.dartsplanet.tv 
and actually send me a message through the website. It's where we do it all. I can keep track. And I'm so silly. So, Gerard, you've, you've won yourself a t-shirt, mate. You were the first one I saw in there for the uh, fit and darts, mate. Well done. That was a great shout as well, because not many people know them. So. See, the minute I've said I'm going to have a go, my darts are now going left, right, up, down, in, out. Well, Matt Doe, Gav, make sure you check your phone after the stream. He's sent you, he's messaged you with a little challenge. Oh, does he? Yeah. There you go, Adam. Look, the minute I said I'm going to play, I've gone from hundreds to ones. Well, why did you say anything? I think that's probably the biggest problem. You, as soon as Do you think there's a lot of people like that? Oh, God, thousands. Uh, Craig Smith, here's one for you, Gav. When's the VOP stream this month, Gav? Is that going to be? Yeah, it'll probably week or be two? in another week or so. Uh, and what we're going to do is we're going to do something very similar to this, where you can come on, answer your questions, and we'll play for some cash prizes. Down South City. So that'll be quite fun. Stephen Urch, aka Tubsy, he says, "Get Paddy back, back, uh, Paddy back, Burke back on." Well, he can get his internet working. We'll see what we can do, but. We've got um, other people to play as yet. I'm throwing horribly tonight. That's because you did what you tell me not to do and you thought about it. Yeah. The minute you think, you just got to play like you normally do. You don't normally think, Connor, so you're normally all right. Are, we, are you ready for me to pull a yeah, name out? Yeah, go and pull a name out. Add, so so I don't know, can be on the Dad, is that a good thing or a bad thing that I don't normally think? Connor, this is yeah. going to be a challenge for you, but be quiet for just 30 seconds. Down. Okay? Right. Chris, a little word. If you oh want, man, unbelievable. Okay, get your live darts up, ready, running. Your three minute starts now. You are going to be playing. Well, Connor, if you go down, yeah. I need to invite. I don't know if I had knows how to do Definitely that. Definitely not. And Connor, why don't you spin your prize wheel? Zero, dear, dear, spin your prize wheel. Yes, yeah, you Yeah, why not? I'm going to be on the right bit. We'll need to move it over to I go. I can do this. I can do this. I'm I can do this. Oh dear, we're in a You'll right need to, Connor, you'll have to do that. Connor, do that! <laughs> yes, sorry guys. I'll be ready. For Wait a minute, prize. Connor. Oh, I'll that's all right. I was ready. in the triple 20 first start. I didn't want to miss it just in case I hit the, the 180. Right. So, Chris, you're playing for. That was a tiny spin as well. It just goes, isn't it? It's like a runaway train ad. Oh no, Jackpot's coming around. Jackpot is. Nah, Jackpot's not coming. It's going to be about 20 quid, maybe. 20 quid? 20, 20 quid! 20, 20 quid. quid! He's going to be rubbing his hands together on this one. I'm going to be even worse than what Connor was. Not that it was bad, because it's all a bit of fun and we love it. I didn't mean it horribly, Connor, you know that, mate. <laughs> that come across wrong. Yeah. Right, uh, so we'll do a bit of commentary. Connor, me and you in the commentary booth for this game. Wow. This is going to be... Do you know what? This is going to be... I, I would put us up there with... Back the in the best. late 90s, John Gwynn and Sid Burdell, mate. Yeah, we are the best, yeah. aren't we? I think and you're commentating on a legend as well, remember? I think part of this is yeah. like, although like we're saying we look up to them, I think they're looking up to us. It's a bit odd for the person, to, the people to be in the commentary box to be more talented than the players they're commentating on as well, isn't it? That's quite That's, rare as yeah. well, so. Hello, right. hello. Hello, Chris. Are you there? My mate Chris Littlewood had some uh, fun with him at Minehead last year. Hey Gareth Connor and everybody, even Gareth, how you doing? Sandy Juliet was even all darts for the TV and fans. Right, well, I, how are you feeling about this then, Gav? It's your first game on the big stage. Dad, I, I've just noticed, I, I would read you as well, but you you change your throw on stream. And yeah, I do, I do. You said that last week. Your throw has totally changed since what you was playing on earlier off the stream. It's showing sure. Gav is it's... playing with a set of 24 gram Phil Taylor darts. Okay, are you ready? And we'll go up for ball then. Go on, Gav. Hit your three, three bullseyes coming there. Can you see me, Gav? We can see your ball. We can see your ball, mate. So it's all, all good. good. How you doing, buddy? Yeah, good. Are you? Yeah, you're going to be even better, shortly. You've got an easy 20 quid coming here. Right, so you've just got to get a 25 to win the throw here, Chris. The only deal is, Chris, is when you win and I meet you at my net next time, you've got to buy me curry and chips. Chris has the throw. Uh, 25, nothing, 25. Good luck, mate. Yeah. You've got to just type that in, Chris, and then you're good to go. Little sip of cider there, always helps. Go on, Dad, good luck. Yeah, yeah. Boom. Yeah. What do you reckon's in the... Um, what do you reckon's in the water on the stage at the Alley Pally? Do you reckon it is just water? 
Good luck, Gav. Yeah, good luck, mate. All the best. I need six darts. Chloe, right. good evening. How you doing? Sue Bird is in. Hello, Sue. Love Sue. Uh, Chris has gone off for a steady 70, Gav, so nothing to fear there. 62. Good darts, Dad. Good darts. Pick one. 62. Oh, that's nice. Looks like a ton there. Nice and straight ton. Good darts, Chris. One hammer. Ah. 37 for Gav. Fraser Gunn loves the most recent batch of dart reviews. He does. Thank you. Thank you, Fraser. Um, we've got some more coming soon. I'll be doing some more. Look at him. He's on for 180. Oh, well, there's already been one of them tonight, hasn't there? Oh, good darts, Chris. Well, good darts, Chris. Start putting a 140 in there. <laughs> you start talking to me before. 140. Chris is on for a 15 dart leg. Yeah. 39. 39. Dad, I know it's easy for me to say, but just run, um, throw slower because uh, I, I know it's easy for me to say, but. Throw like you don't care, but do care. 100. Yeah, good out, Chris. Uh, you don't want me throwing over that way towards you. <laughs> yeah. 12, 12. So Chris has left 91 after 12. Yeah? 100. Yeah, oh, hello. 101. Well, I'm at 260s in this, so I'm quite happy. 89, I reckon that's a two, so 89. Ah. Oh. Forty-five. See, people talk about averages. Chris was averaging over hundred until that throw. It just yeah. shows you how how averages can lie. Yes, yeah, just drop, can't yeah, it? Yeah, just drop. It's just such. This is like he wants double top here for a 17, 18 darts. Ah. See, and now straight away his average will drop right down. So stop talking about averages, people, oh, and just play. Oh God. Thirty-three for Gav. I tell you what, I'm happy. I'm in the hundreds. Thirty-three. No score. No score for Chris. No, no Gavin, a little 140 here, and that might make that double 10 shrink a bit for Chris. No, no score. 15? No. no. Still, oh, am I going to be reviewing the shot darts? We don't do shot darts yet. Hopefully, yeah, we will do one. some. Well done, Chris. Well done, Chris. You've got 20 quid on the way. Cheers, lads. Thank you. Lovely. How you doing? You all right, mate? Yeah, very good. Are you? Yeah, what have you been up to? Yeah, I think you see me now. Oh, he's wearing you wearing the shirt I sent you, my Boom Boom one. <laughs> You're a bloody legend, mate. <laughs> Absolutely. I knew you'd laugh when you got... I thought, what T-shirt should I send him? I thought, I'll send him one of my Boom Boom ones. Uh, yeah, <laughs> quality, mate. I had to, to wear it for the stream. Absolutely awesome. So you're going up to... I'm um, hopefully going to go on my head next year, yeah? Yeah, definitely, yeah. That'll be good. You're going to go with the same guys that you went with last time? Is what, sorry? You're probably going to go with the same guys that you went with last time, the same group of you? Yeah, yeah, same guys we've been for the last four or five years together, so we, we book up straight away, it's a really good weekend. I'll definitely try and get up there and do something, I always sort of, I get on really well with Jess Harden from JBD as well, top bloke, we do all the fan zone and that. Yeah, great stuff, uh, yeah, it'd be great to see you again anyway. Yeah, alright mate, will you stay safe, thank you so much for being a VIP member and everything as always, buddy. Yeah, you take care, guys. Just, just send me your PayPal thing on the website and I'll uh, put 20 quid in for you tomorrow, mate. Lovely. Take care. Well will play, Chris. Well, well play, mate. Later. Cheers. Thank you so much. Good, good steady leg of darts, that. Well that done. was good steady yeah, leg of darts. Leg of darts so. That was good. Well, I, said, I weren't too bad. I hit 360s. I'm really, you know, really pleased with that. Uh, Craig C. Adam, I've just ordered the Harrow's Paragon um, after watching your review. Well, Harrow's, see, it works. Hello, <laughs> our beautiful faces are back. Yes, we are. we are. What else have we got coming up? What we're going to do is, Peter Reynolds tried this a minute ago, but don't think it worked. Well, well it has so now, Can I show off one of my talents? Yeah. That's not necessarily one to be proud of, <laughs> uh, to be fair. Did, but what I want to know is, is can, can you, you do it? Well, no. But can he, you do it? I'm not even going to ask him who, who taught him that, to be fair, in your house. But can <laughs> you no, work? of course I can't. <laughs> <laughs> you told me you was agile. <laughs> Um, what else have we got here? Uh, 
There's no actual comments in at the moment. So what we're going to do is we're definitely going to have another game. Um, did we read Dave's one out? Gave us set away in last month. Yeah, Dave's talked about the Paragons as well. He thinks oh. they're a lovely dart, awesome dart. He likes them. Unlucky, says super fan Charlie the Boss Grey. What we're going to do is we are going to go back on the board. Adam's going to get straight back onto it and he's going to give somebody two cash games in a row now. And me and Connor will uh, just yes, sir. talk. Talk the show away, won't we, mate? Yeah, me and my beautiful dad. Certainly. Let's put it back on to Connor, uh, on to Ad then. There we go. It'd be nice if the jackpot one come out now. Go, do you want to pull one of those? Oh, though, wait a minute. Yeah, we better go back, actually, Connor, because we need to do the wheel. Uh, let's pull and one out. Here yeah. we go. Helpers, Dave Collins. Just take that over. My mate, this is the guy that is sponsoring the show. This is Pure Innocence himself. Ice Cold Collins. Uh, we're actually on that camera. Oh, yeah, no, that's fine. We're on that one over there. But we need to go back, Connor, because we need to spin the prize <laughs> wheel. Connor's getting ahead of himself. No, this is Adam was showing it. Come on, Dave Collins. What are you playing for? Dave, you're playing for. Just make sure that it's invited us on there, actually, Connor. You'll need to refresh it. Oh, God. Your three minutes starts now. What is his username, Ad? It was, uh, I it's there, it's Ice Cold Collins. Ice Cold Collins. 15 pounds, you were playing for 15 pounds. I thought you were going to say 50 then. When you it's said. Ice Cold Collins, has he invited us? No. Did you refresh it? He hasn't. I'll refresh it one more time. Refresh it one more time, because we don't want anybody to miss out. If not, I'm going to be doing a draw for the next person. Nope. He didn't. Dave, you're not on there, mate. Really, really sorry about this. Uh, next up is Adam Gorefrock. Oh. The winner of the awesome prize uh, this week, the mystery boxes. Incredible. Oh, he's on a, he's on a right roll then, winning there. He's on there. Is he not? Wait no. a minute, let me just check. Oh, yeah, he's he's ADSG. I, I know, I remember. He's Refresh it one more time. ADSG, we're just double checking. If not, we're going to move on to the next one. Nope. No, Adam's not on there either, no? Nope. Is Dwayne Lee Pruitt on there? He's yes, it. Dwayne Lee Pruitt is on, Connor. Dwayne, you have got three minutes to connect and give Adam a game to win yourself 15 quid. Let's see how he's playing, uh, Cons. Hey, guys. Hello, Hello mate. Guys. You're in Canada, aren't you? Is board cam on? Because I'm going to get underneath. How's it going? How you doing? You're out in Canada, aren't you, Dwayne? Yeah, yeah, I got everything going. Is everything okay? Yes, yeah, good, mate. Thank you for all your support, mate. You've been a huge support of the channel for ages now. No problem, no problem, thank you. Uh, absolutely yeah, love it, mate. Glad you're glad to get back the game. Yeah, looking forward to it, mate. You're, pla you're playing for 15 quid as well, so good luck. You're live on Darts Planet TV. Enjoy it, mate. Enjoy it, mate. Up the ball, eh? Up, Up the, the ball. ball. I'll go, I'll go. Oh, rubbish. Oh, even more rubbish. Nothing. Been watching too much of me, Adam. <laughs> absolutely nothing. Ad, I think I'd beat you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's got a ball. Uh, good darts. Good darts, Dwayne. Good darts, Dwayne. Thank you, thank you. Good luck, Adam. Yeah, have a good game, pal. Good luck, mate. Oh, nice 60. 60. Yeah, 60 to start with. 60. 59. Good darts, Ad. Yeah. 59. 41. As much as I don't like looking at Connor, is showing him not the board. What was that? Oh, sorry? it comes to the board. He's seeing Connor. I said, as much as I like looking at Connor, is showing him and not the board. Oh yeah, because we're because we're live streaming, Dwayne. We're actually got it live on YouTube, so we can't use the cameras. So we have to do it that way, mate. Just a sixty for me. Oh, of course, yeah, sixty. Yeah, that must be. Let's turn that one off so I don't put my fuse put the camera. 
That's the, there you go. 45. There you go, we've turned it off for you now, mate, to make it a little easier. 45. Oh, 45. Thank you, Steve. Steve saying, well done, Gav. Set up the camera's looking good tonight. Thank you so much. Yeah, we're getting there. We're really pleased with how it's working. 45. Ninety-six. That. Not much in this one, Ed. No, not very friendly leg of dance, this one so far. Dark sky. Sixty. Oh, Adam. Forty one. Forty one. Fifty five. Right, let's see if I can set up this two hundred. Fifty five. Not like that, I'm not. Oh dear. 24. Close. 24. Yeah, good, good last start. Right, 176. 85. Oh, 83. That's all right. Thank you, Stephen. Three. My live darts found webcam, each leg even, except that everything worked briefly, then went off. We're going to probably try knacker next week. Cheers, Stephen. New magazine's great. Absolutely love it. Thank you so much. Can't right. leave I left my darts at your house. 93 Six. for me. So because Dwayne's on a finish, you've got to go bullseye route, really. Can't wait to meet you either, Harry Butcher. We'll have a food beers. 84. Oh, Adam. I have just scored there 17. <laughs> Don't matter, mate. <laughs> Ducks. <laughs> 17. Right, please work up. Go. Go for it. Seventy-six. Twenty-nine. Oh, seventy-one. Fifty-four. Tops left for me. Thirty-six. We all love these games, Ad. Lawrence Kelman. Crack and feed tonight, guys. So chuffed with my win, but shame I couldn't beat 36. Adam. Oh, well, he wants forty-seven. Twenty-eight left. Double 14. Double 14, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, unlucky. Unlucky time. Right, 40. 14 left. Oh, no, 26. 26. Thank you, Charlie Gray. Yeah, looking forward to issue 17. And he's being sensible to you, Connor, says Charlie, the boss Gray. Oh, 51. 26. We both want double seven. Not if you need that. Yeah. Yeah, well done, Dwayne. Well, well done, Dwayne. Uh, Dwayne, thank you so much. That is uh, 15 pounds on the way to you. If you just move back there and bring it back over here, Connor. Well done, mate. Well, well done, done, mate. Thank well you, done. you so much, and thank you for all your support. It's absolutely awesome. Thank you, guys. 
Alright, yeah. bye. Take care, mate. Thank you. Speak to you soon. Bye, Dwayne. Right, we're just going to have a look at some of the questions and then we're going to wrap it up and get into the draw. Any of the raffle we we'll we'll Oh yes, we've got one more. We've got one more game. Huh? Um, we've got one more game. Adam's going to do one more cash I game. Think we need five. No, we said we'd do one more for Adam. That'll be fine. Oh, yeah. And then we're going to do the raffle. Um, so uh, let's just go through the raffle prices just one more time. I know we keep going on about it, but they're fantastic prizes. If you go over here and have a look, first prize is the Bully Boy uh, Smith top. One pound uh, for every pound you put in, you're going to get a chance to win that. Crack and prize. The mystery box worth forty pounds, and the win more blackout darts. Fantastic prizes. Mystery box uh, two. Which one did Dave go for? Him was it mystery box one. one, wasn't it? So mystery box two is gonna stay up there, um, and we've got the obviously the VIP draw to do as well. Adam, are you feeling it? I think you need to get back on that practice board for a few more minutes. While me and Connor, we're gonna get the prize board out again and see who's up. Here we go, cons. Craig Smith, Smithy180. Craig Smith, just see if Craig Smith has invited us. He's going to be up and playing live on the stream. Oh, dear. Oh, my dearie me. I'm here. Here she comes, Winter Stewart. Let's just see, Laura. Let's see what Craig Smith is up for winning, and then you can come and take the seat. Craig Smith. Matthew 180. He hasn't you won this. Won. No, he's not won it. He's oh, going to be playing. Is he on there, Connor? To win. No, nope. still looking for him. Oh, um, I'm sure he was on there, Smithy. Shepard is on as Jiminy, Jiminy Boy. He said he's up for a game for a tenner. I'm sure Smithy was on there. He's not, Dad. No? No. Smithy is not on there. We've got to do the ones that we put in here, Laws. Oh, We've got yeah. to do it all live yeah. and uh, do it fairly. Oh, hey, yeah, I can see Smithy 180. Oh yeah, he's on there. <laughs> Smithy, you are on there, Race please. Five. Oh so, yeah, but we'll just play one leg. It don't make the difference. Yeah, okay, that's, okay. We can just play one leg. There we go. Smithy, right. one eighty. Just turn that camera off, sure. please. No, I am a handsome fellow. Uh, Laura, you can come and sit in on the stream here, look, and look directly into the camera. Mum, come sit next to your beautiful mum. No, mum, sit next to your beautiful son. Next to your beautiful son. Oh come on. Move him out the way, mate. Mum, you're getting better on Mario, aren't you? Oh, I tell you what. We've got the Nintendo Switch. Uh, the kids have been amazing at helping pack orders, haven't they? They are good. Sometimes they are we're good. out there for like 12 but, hours. But the so thing is, is the, the, payment, as payment, we got them a week. Yeah. But we do pay them as well, and we do yeah. love them. Yeah. But I love that the other day, and I know I've said this before when I go out there, and Connor's helped me, and I love him dearly, and he's out there, and he's sort of like this, and I say, Connor, and he went, do you know what, Dad? I'd rather work in the co-op than help you <laughs> pack orders. I said, are you being serious? He, oh, went, he went, yeah, just watch that phone now. Uh, he said, I would rather work in the co-op. Unbelievable. It's just whenever Fraser Gunn whenever, saying, whenever, here is the gaffer. Whenever we're packing it, it's, it's the same thing. We've got to put the letter in, put the magazine in, seal it. Make sure it's But do you, not get, do you not feel rewarded oh, to think that all these dark fans all, all over the world... Excuse me, I'm just saying hello to our fans. To your uh, fans? fans? Hi, Vicky. Lots of love to you. Fraser. Oh, Fraser. I'll tell you what. When the, when Fraser's going to buy us a smoked uh, sausage supper when we go up there. <gasps> oh, my gosh. No, he didn't say that, really. We'll buy Fraser oh. one, though. I was just getting your hopes up. God, what Mum, did you get the ice cream? I smoked sausage supper. No, because... I, I think, is this three minutes up? Smithy's taking Dad's, his time here. Dad's wallet was in here. And I, I didn't come back in again. Um, but, can I just... I want to just... Button Wait a minute. Here. Well, you oh. need to take them over to... Smash no, let's just do it at the end. We need to finish the games off and oh, do them all okay. at the end, Laws. Okay, Smithy is not connected, unfortunately. So we're going to have oh, to pull Johnny. the next one out. We love fitness oh, Dwayne. Our hair yeah. is also still looking great. Can I just say something? You know how like all my jokes on Dark Side TV are the best out there, aren't they? My jokes are the best. I've got another joke, and it is probably the best of the best. Why did the fish blush? Because it saw the ocean's bottom. Connor, that's my joke. You always steal They're always stealing, they're always stealing each joke? other's jokes. Connor always steals my jokes. Right, let's get to this. Martin Thompson. Is Martin Thompson on there, Connor? Yeah, I remember We've got one him. more game. If Martin Thompson's on there, you're going to get a chance to play for oh. £10. Pounds. Oh, God, 
Please, How please about please a muscle? Oh, we go to Lucas all the time. That's the ice cream shop, isn't it? That's where mum was. I used oh to my work god. In Lucas, when um, I was a teenager, and I started off as a waitress. Yeah, Martin Thompson's up there. And then I progressed up to the front counter. Mm. Uh, I loved my job at Lucas. I'd have been sacked for eating all the ice cream. Well, I've got an ice cream, well, an ice pop addiction. I don't know, you know the Mr. Freezers, though? How much of it? You know the Mr. Freezers? We don't buy the small ones, we buy the 150 mil ones. Yeah. And I could sit here, no word of a lie, and eat oh. 15 in a night. I have got a massive, massive Mr. Freeze addiction. Little Willie's in, says Fraser. Oh, <laughs> Little Willie's <laughs> in. Willie McNeil de Rolos. is awesome. You will never believe it. I also worked for De Rolo's ice cream, which is the other Italian families. And aren't they I just around the corner as well, aren't they? No, De Rolo's is opposite the front and hall. Okay. And oh. Luca's is the other side, yeah. beside where Uncle Pete and Aunt Lorraine are. But uh, I worked in the office in De Rolo's and I went to school with my very good friend, Manny. Let me on. just change it, change, change it. Board cam on, is it? I haven't moved. Uh, we haven't moved. Adam's just hit a whack. Go on, Adam, do your bit. You can leave it on that screen. <laughs> 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 oh, Laura, you can do the other side. You can do the. Oh, I'm running out of time. Tell you what, I'm really disappointed, guys. Uh, uh, is this the night dark? Wait a minute, go on then. Oh. Your microphone oh. appears to be noisy, Luke. Okay, well, Martin's isn't going to work either. We're going to try tell you what, one more. I'm really disappointed that I haven't seen any of you guys react to my amazing joke. It's really Alan McRae. Alan McRae. Let's see. Um, I'm absolutely gutted for you guys to know there's money up for grabs, but there's nothing that we can do. But next week, we're going to move from Lie Dance and we're going to try Knacker because m lots more of you have said you've had better success. Is Alan McRae on there? Is Mac One Connor? Mac, Mac One's one. there. Mac one's there, but it's not like. Well, yeah. that side. He's on the No, no, he's on the left hand side. Is Mac one there? No. Requested us for a game? No. no. Okay, let's get another one. <laughs> Richard Lusardi. Yes, he's hey, on there. Yeah, Richard oh, on there. Is he having a bath? <laughs> he's in the bath. He's playing, he's playing in the bath. <laughs> let's just go over to this other screen here. Oh, super. Me and Dad also, I want to tell the... Uh, Just turn that camera off, I want to tell the Dark Side TV that um, we have our thing that we do a lot, don't we? It's, it's a song we have and we always do it. We go, straight life. When you got, got nowhere to go. go. Straight life. It is the, the only, only place I know. And then we make something up the next life. I come it. round the tea. What's the other one? Street life. Right, here we got Mr. Lusardi. Lusardi has wow. especially got out of the bath to play you this evening. I've been oh, yeah. oh, did you see that picture that he sent in? Um, oh, Vicky's asking, Connor, they want to do a shout out. They're saying they love you for Chloe and Kelsey. Oh, they're shouting at Connor for Chloe and Kelsey. Shout out to Chloe and Kelsey Rouse. The, the uh, Rouse family are always we in. Love we, you uh, we love you guys so much. They're so kind. We, uh, we need to do one of them Nexus things again, but yeah. Awesome, we love uh, the Rouses. Fraser, DPTV is the creme de la creme, absolutely. Thank you so much, Fraser. We have, su we have such a blast, don't we? Yeah. yeah. Mum, do you like being through here in the celebrity studio? <laughs> Actually, I've, I've been... Um, like I don't think that it is going to work. I think yeah, we're going to have to wrap up. It's 8.37. We'll be gone Dad, for a long, long time. Do you time. want to... Wait a minute, Cons, we'll just switch. I don't think anyone wants to play me. No, wait a minute, Cons. Oh, we're switching. Yeah, we're just going to switch on here. Should I just have three darts? Do so what we're going to do is we're going to wrap this up there, but Laura just wants to go through the um, awesome stuff from Pure Innocence and Alan and different things. There's going to be a VIP member win this this evening. It's an absolutely oh. incredible prize. It's now, full of all these ointments and... Um, Pure Innocence, Alan Collins and uh, Mark from Pure Innocence are absolutely amazing, amazing guys. And I've, uh, obviously, because of my condition, you I've a lot researched of it, yeah. a lot about what is good for my body and what isn't good for my body. 
um, weaned myself off a lot of the medication um, that I didn't think was working, but obviously I still have to take a bit. But anyway... And apparently these ones are aphrodisiacs, so I'm going to be hiding these at night, Laura, so that you take more of these. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Wait, what? You're talking about stuff. You don't need to know. Right. You don't need yeah. to know. Sorry, Laura. It's fine. Means, means, means. Out of your face. Means you might find out how you learned to do your trick. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Connor's face over there is absolutely that's, brilliant. That, that I love it. That's your innocence, Gavin. <laughs> Dad's just Um. Tell you what, I'm going to get you back. No, listen. Oh, dear. Enough. You said it. Enough. 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 Well, Alan, we love you too, and um, I had the most amazing conversation with Mark, and he is so qualified in this field, and he's done so much work. Uh, they work with all the top bodies across uh, the sports industries. Um, they even work on the Olympics. They are just incredible and they have so kindly donated us this amazing hamper which has got um, pure innocence, 140 milligram CBD oil. There's also 280. We've got uh, the cannabis oil caps. We've got the muscle salve and the muscle salve uh, because I don't have any fluid around my joints and my hips, and this has been an absolute godsend. You'd be good on QVC as well, you know. Ooh. That shopping channel? No, I'm back no, you would, but it's good. Oh, you are going to become a hairdresser? Yeah. Because awesome. of pure innocence. Laura, you've done this today, this fabulous, with a bit of a fade here. I don't know if the guys yeah. can see that it. That looks good. Um, that suits you. I think, I think the key thing about pure innocence is that there is zero THC in their stuff, which means for those of you who don't know, that none of these products have the the kind of psychological effects that um, some products can have, yeah. and also it's completely vegan friendly, environmentally friendly, and there is just so much stuff here. It's absolutely loads. To help we'll the workouts and um, I have been. I have tried literally everything. You, what the is the seizures. one that you have when you have yeah. your seizures and you put it underneath your tongue that we do? Mark, um, Mark has taught me that you'll get CBD oil and people think, oh, I'm in pain or, you know, I need the best performance and they go for a really strong dose. But we've all got a natural cannabis, cannabis yeah. gene that's been dormant because we used to eat plants. We used yeah, to exactly. Eat, I was out the front garden eating weeds, wasn't I? Yeah, but, save me a job of that. But what we've done... <laughs> like, say, no, uh, no, just listen, see Laura actually the weeds. What we've done over the years, if we've suppressed that, that cannabis, oil, cannabis gene, and the really good thing about the discussion I had with Mark is he taught me people who go for these really massively high strengths, it has the opposite effect to what it should have. So it was amazing to be able to have a chat with Mark. You can chat on the website. Yeah. Uh, there's so much stuff I to think... find out. And this stuff is, I have been taking it. Um, and Mark told me to build it up gradually. Stop laughing. I'm not laughing at all. I'm just thinking that uh, you're doing an amazing yeah. job. But it, it's yes. Father's Day and we've got lots to get through. Thank you so much for uh, that science uh, lecture. Alan and that are absolutely amazing. But what we're going to do Wait is... Wait yeah. oh, okay. Just hang on. The key thing is that... <laughs> with... Stop it! I'm, I'll be innocent in all this. Yeah, the key is thing fun. is that um, when I have a seizure... It does take a huge amount out of my body, but we found that if the kids or gag, if I'm having a seizure, give me the medication, then give me this, or I manage to have it before the seizure, it's much shorter and my recovery time is much, much quicker. So right, thank you very much, Mum. Moving on. <laughs> so, <laughs> thank you very much, uh, Lord. That was and absolutely I do, incredible. I will do my very own. <laughs> And, uh, and what we wanted to say is, what we wanted to say is, um, we're going to be doing this draw, and Laura, you can actually uh, pick the winner 
and also VIP members are going to be able to get, uh, I think it's something like 10 or 13% off um, through the VIP area. So let's do the draw for this. So Ellie the Raffle Rookyard, can you bring in the VIP members? And like I said, a massive thank you to Mark and Alan. Let's see who's going to get there. Says, Pipe down, Gav. Gav, pipe down. Says, yeah, I'm gonna hear Gav, what remember here. who is in charge? The boss has spoken. Here yeah. come all yeah. the right, tickets. I'll, everyone's I'll done. Over to the raffle. I'll go back and see the dog. Okay, well, it's been emotional. Should we have our weekly little hug? Come on, let's just do it. Well, I think if she's taken some of that medication, it might be a bit more of a weekly hug. They're the wrong ones. We'll have our weekly <laughs> hug and take these with you, all right? And I'll see you in about half an hour. <laughs> Sorry, oh, Connie, you're going red. Cool. Yeah, thank you. Oh dear, no, that happy was short lived. And happy Father's Day, Dad. <laughs> Scoop Steve. Come on then, Raffler. Raffler's going to come in. We're going to have five more minutes. Just to let you know, you've got five more minutes to pack any last money in for the Michael Smith shirt, the blackout darts, and the £40 mystery box. It's a fantastic prize. It's worth a go. But Ellie the Raffler is in now for yes. this wonderful. Pure Innocence Prize. How much was it worth again, Lars, just before you go? Uh, up to £500. One lucky VIP member is going to have it on the way to you. So, uh, let's do the draw. You guys pick it. Oh, Raffler. Yeah. Salada. Yeah, the winner salad. of no, the what? Pure Innocence Prize. This is one seriously, is. seriously good prize. Number 272. 272. 272 is Alan McRae. Alan McRae has yes. won this awesome Pure Innocence. Um, congratulations, mate. It's a fantastic prize. You're going to absolutely love it. Once again, a massive thank you to Alan and also um, Mark as well. So we've just got a couple of minutes to the raffle, but just before we go to that, uh, any last uh, goes that you want? We'll just see what Ellie's been up to this week. What have you been up to, um, babe? Uh, well, the switch has been really fun. We've got that. Uh, Mum and Dad treated us to that, which we're really grateful for. Uh, me and Connor have been playing it, and Connor's already completed a game already on that. that Pokemon. really cool. Yeah. Um, doing he was up at six o'clock the other morning. <laughs> Yeah, he was. He was um, up all night. and then he Well, was he was actually trying to convince me to come down and have an all-nighter, didn't he? I actually come down at, and spoke to him about eight, and I come back, and at nine o'clock, all I could hear was... <laughs> and I come through, and I said to him, and he'd been up early hours playing this Pokemon, because he said to me, it's like work, Dad. You know when you get this thing in your head, and you know you've got to complete it? I need to get up. And I was like, really? He was like... And then we were doing Chinese Pokemon. I love how he referred to it being the same as Dad's work. Like you know what it's like, don't you? When you've well, you got to catch them all, don't you? Yeah. Come on. Yeah, <laughs> okay, so any, let's just see if there's well, any uh, last ones right. coming in. I'll quickly go write the last ones. That last one's in. coming in. It's 8.46. We're going to wrap this at 8.48. Max Haley is saying, already a winner. Hitting my first ever nine data. It is the power of darts from that TV. Leighton Bennett come along and hit his first nine data. We're on the show. You hit a nine data. What else happened, Adam? When? Whenever. There's loads of magical you stuff You hit happened. two Lots. fours in a row. Yes. Yeah. You, yeah. you, you were okay. Connor was okay. Did we pull over in the garage and you went on the scratch card or something? No, I did get a scratch card today. I thought I'd change my life. I even rung you up, didn't I? To say I'd he rang me up to say he was going to change his life with the scratch card. Yeah, I didn't win. I don't think I've ever won on that, you know, scratch card. Exactly. Uh, just a few things before we go. Loads coming up next week. Um, we're going to uh, potentially do some more mystery boxes. We're going to do some more giveaways. Keep an eye out in the VIP area. There is more and more happening. This is my full-time job now. I have to pinch myself. I feel the luckiest guy in the world. Adam's got some fantastic reviews coming out over the next week. Yeah, we've got Winmore stuff, Red Dragon stuff, and Elm Style stuff. Yeah, so and we've obviously we've got some that we've pre-recorded last week. We've got some we've done as well, yeah. We've got, so. we've got some more Coos School and cameos, so you're going to see a lot of this beautiful face over the next week Fabulous. or so. Um, so I think that is it, Ellie. Any last ones coming in, babe? Uh, I just added the last ones that have come in, so... There we go. So let's do the draw. Let's just have a look. Uh, loads of people are saying well done. Rousey is saying, have a great week ahead, everybody, and you and your family. Hope you enjoyed your Father's Day uh, present. Chris Scholar is in Chris with three quid. just coming quid. with three quid. Three quid, Ellie. Ellie. We're just going to have to put three quid in oh. for Chris Scholar. If you pass that to uh, making darts look sexy, Adam. Thanks again. Thank you, Dave. Absolute pleasure. Alan Collins. 
was a boom boom moment that on YouTube for anyone who had not seen it. It must have been my one eighty is talking about, isn't it? Uh, no, I think he might uh, be referring to the other Boom Boom, the less well-known Boom Boom, Gav, Mr Bennett, I think he's referring no, to. No, he's got a big tournament, aren't I, the real Boom Boom? <laughs> uh, what else have we got? Well done on the nine. It's nice to see all the support. James Shepherd, uh, you should be so lucky. Chris, so they're obviously having a conversation as well. Right, here we come, Raffler. So, third prize tonight. Four. In they go. Chris, <laughs> you've just got in. Where, where is all the prizes? Let me just... uh, uh, so there's your blackouts and a bully boy shirt and a mystery box to the value of forty pounds, isn't it? Plus. Yes. Awesome. So third prize. The well, win more blackout. Go on, Raffler, you do it. Oh, Look at our mix up, Bell. <laughs> a Raffler card. I always play glasses up. Yeah. How do you go? Stop. Sometimes you do it with a little finger and have a pinky out. Andy Rouse. Andy Rouse. Andy yes. Rouse. Danger Mouse Rouse. You have yes. won it. Alan Collins is in with 20 quid. We're going to have to put you in next week now, Alan. We will do that for you. Well done oh, to the Rouse family. Yes. Yeah. Well done, SW, Squibbly, Wibbly, Woo Wah, Woo, whatever I call you. Congratulations to <laughs> yeah. you on the way. Yeah, Alan's just been a comment. That's for a round of drinks for the staff. Oh, oh thank, thank you. you, mate. Thank you. Absolute legend. Uh, second prize, the mystery box worth 40 quid. Who's going to have that tonight? Just gonna have it. I make my prediction. Wait for it. Wait for I'm going to make mine. Is he, is he the guy who beat me? I'm going to make mine. He's already at the jackpot tonight. Sean Kirkbride. Sean Kirkbride, you have just won yourself a mystery you know box that. worth 40 pounds. Congratulations. Elliot, you want these all down, my darling? Yeah, we'll, we'll look back on the stream. We will anyway, look back so. on the stream. And, right, and I think this one is going to be Alan Aldridge. Because you remember they're £25. So Alan Aldridge. Where is the shirt gone? No. Disneyland? I'm sure it'll turn up. <laughs> I don't even know where and it is. There it is. Raffler. Pre there you go. On for there you go. Uh, good luck to everybody. One of you is going to get your hands on this. There you go, Alan, Alan Aldridge. Aldridge, my early prediction. Come on. Probably really going to start on the shirt. Okay. The winner is... Ellie, just do the suspense, like build it up a little bit. Who could yes. win the Michael Smith shirt? Who is it? Mark Smith. Mark Smith! Congratulations, mate. You have got this signed Bully Boy shirt. It is going to be on its way to you. Congratulations to everybody that has took part. One tonight, joined in. I hope you've enjoyed the show. I hope you've enjoyed our new setup. We've still got more to come. Massive thank you to Eddie the Raffle Rook Guard. My good mate, Ad. Absolutely you awesome. And song. Connor. Um, thank you so much. Listen, guys, stay safe. Keep an eye out on the website. Keep an eye out for more announcements about our darts. Um, and also... Don't forget to send your photos in. I just want to quickly show you. I know I did earlier. We've got a fan zone at the back of the magazine. There's and then a great on picture pages, in the middle there is of Adam. He wants that. Page 36 and 37. Just look at that. This magazine is all about you guys. It's glossy. Um, it's got all the DP TV army. And we absolutely love featuring you. Dance Planet TV is full of fans. Made for the fans. And we will catch you all the same time next week. Stay safe, guys. And thank you so Bye. much. Stay safe. Bye.